Okay, here's one's today's visit. Uh, mind undone. Undown. Wait. Because what he said, um, mind blown. Oh well. He must have got confused. I usually am. Why not him? Um, right, so there's a freighter. Ooh, I can't steer now. Silly boy. A bit closer. There we are. Let's get out. Ah, okay. It's night time. This is handy. We can see what lights are available. Let's get out and have a quickie looky. Quickie looky. Quickie looky. Um, okay, so it's not a freighter. Or freighter, crash freighter site at least. It's not on a freighter, obviously. That would be stupid, right? Because that would be lying. Let's stand up here, shall we? Oh, I missed. <laughs> Very good. Okay, we're up on top of here. So, aquatic connection. Uh, straight tubes. Oh, okay, so they're bent into a curve. What do we go down the bottom? Bottom is a load of race initiators, giving it a nice light look. Uh, we got some enterable levels in there. I don't know, is that four? Four? Four floors, probably. Not sure. And then the reverse of the bottom is on the top. Okay, well all we got to do is wait for daylight so we can see what we're doing and hopefully I can find my feet. Let's get off. See you in the morning. Okay, so there's morning. Uh, like I said, it's built on top of a freighter site. Uh, the planet looks nice. It's kind of Earth-like except for the Red Sea. <laughs> but apart from that, Minimal Sentinels. Not a bad place. It's in Euclid, so everyone's been here. Or this galaxy at least. Where were we going next? We're going to look at the bottom of the pier and the top. So we're just going to drop over the camera a second. So here's the very base. Looks like one of those red fishes on there, so that's okay. I've come around to the sunny side. we we'll draw back as we... Uh, Hit things. Let's get to the top level and see what the. I think the top is exactly the same as the bottom. So um, uh, they're those um, uh, speed ups for uh, the race place, and there is the top at this end. So I think it looks exactly the same. So that's okay. Nice. Crossover on the top there. Let's get off. Well, not get off. to the camera away. That's what I meant to say. Not get off. Right, so where is we going? I think we go across through these underwater passageways first. Um, they are a bent. You can see the differences. They're bent. They seem brighter than usual for me. I don't know. Are they brighter? Okay, it says, welcome you bloody bastard. Right. Um, <clears throat> door. Must be a door. Kind of hexagonally opened. That's pretty clever. Uh, ooh, what the? Might as well get fried by laser beams there. That's an interesting piece of artwork. <laughs> Very. Um, okay, well, we're going to leave the centre part. We'll come back to that bit, I think. We're going to do the outsides. Talking of outside, there's the outside. It's got a wire hider underneath there. That's handy. And the generators. I don't think it's used. I'll have to check if I can. Right, it's going down. Let's have a look. Going off to the left, what they need is just a complete circle room. Uh, we've got more of these um, art structures using the salvage bits. 
the uh, corrupt Sentinel planet sh ship and a bogey on top. Is that added on as well? Is that another light bulb in front of it? Or something? I don't recognise it. Ooh, okay. Nothing unusual there anyway. Okay, so this bloke's had his feet chomped off by a hungry skeletal. Another uh, piece of mechanical art. Where did you get this stuff from? Which have you glitched it in with a blender or something? <laughs> Um, I think there's no way up there. It's in a bowl. Well, it's in a glass tube. Okay, that explains why we can't go up there. There's a generator in there. I don't know if it's generator number 31, but I don't think it's actually connected. Let's have a look. No status, no connection. Okay. But another pile of stuff. Good modern art. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Stand a bit close to that light bulb. Um, which way are you going? You're going to the tubes going that oh no, it's not tube. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Or is it an aquatic door? Or oh, it's possibly an aquatic door. With a ossified star and hex plate, probably. Not sure. Okay. Uh, that's the way back up. So is that the way we came in? There's the bogey. Okay. What's in the middle? Just a piece of glass. He says, standing on it very unwearingly. So there's the base cone on the bottom. One big piece. I don't think there's a way in there. So that's out of the question. <laughs> Let's, um, where's the bloody transporter gone? Cooey, over here. Right, let's get up here. We're going left-ish. Wait, did I go down? I think I just come straight back down again. Hang on. Go up. And then turn. Before I step off. Okay, we stepped off. Nice. Right, so what we got around here? Kind of these buggers. Placed on top and upside down. Well, one's upside down. Uh, we've got a cuboid room in here. It's got power. Well, how do you get power? Oh. Well, I guess that just means to turn the power off. Uh, you're in here with the, the galactic terminal and the science station. Hello, science station. Nobody working here. It wouldn't be anyway. Kaushi Shroom. We're not interested in the middle at the moment. Um, from that angle, it kind of looked like a robot face. <laughs> With three eyes. Not really three eyes. And it's more sparky bits. Nice. Uh, this is, must be the other door. Going off to the base computer. We're going to do the base computer now then. We just rush around here. Without my feet, I don't know whether I'm stepping in the gap anyway. Okay, definitely the other flight deck has the base computer on it. So we're going to check, get the coordinates. And it definitely says mind unblown. Bricks build. Well, that's the coordinates. We're going to go all the way back now. So give us another chance to look at the lovely terrain. <laughs> Oops, I don't know where I'm walking because I can't see me. Alright, so we go back in the door again. Uh, so this must be all the way round so far. Oh, we got um That's a bit big. The weapons man table. Bloody expanding cube gadgets, huge. And that's the middle again. 
So is there anything else I should know about around here? How do I get to the other two levels? Oh, I guess up the stairs. That would be helpful. Okay, upstairs. We really got stuck there for some reason. A nice... <laughs> His hand. I think he's, um, if I stand there with my bollocks, do you think I'll get a tickle? No, okay. Uh, bits and bobs. And I guess we're going up. Upstairs again. Probably. Let's try and look, ooh, we're going left? I guess we're going left. Although, the fill's left. That's only because I'm facing this way. I think that's what helps me get lost. Nothing behind the tables. Um, there's not a table, a counter. Uh, we got one storage container and some grass. And a refiner. Is that a bit big? It's enlarged. Wow, you've got a big one. More grass and another container. Shrunk. So we have a big one and a shrunk one. Oh crap. Uh, we have another up. Do we have another up? Yeah, just about make the up. Let's go. Padunk. Let's just turn and step off. So we have another single room. Single room? Well, there's only one room. So I guess it's a single room. Let's go around the corner. We've got another one going up. Yeah, we'll take the up. And steppy offy. So we got another one room job. And there's the other half of the uh cone at the top. Huge. A uh, bit like a steeplejack. Okay. Right, we got gamma weed growing out of the wall. And star uh, bramble. And of course cactus flesh. I actually don't take up that much room, does it? That's handy. Takes up less than a couple of pots. Previous base item cash. But they can be whatever you believe them to be. Mordite roots and gravitinos. And a chair. Just so you can sit down, relax, look at your strawberries. Um, more grass, gut rots, and selenium, solar vine. I keep calling it selenium, don't matter. And that's all the way round, basically. So, the floor is crisscrossy. We go down. We've got nowhere else to go up here, so we'll have to go down. Let's just check we actually went down. Apparently so. Right, so there is a teleporter. base terminus in this case, isn't it? Uh, I guess we're going back down again. Okay. Down. Try not to step on anybody's nose. Which way did we come from? That end? Oh, I think so. Yeah, we were going this way. Uh, we got ossified stars growing in a biodome. <laughs> and, you know, Gamma weed with a bogey looking after it. Is there a door around here? No. Plenty of windows, but no doors. Well, I'm saying that, but there's a door here. Wait. Big floor plates, all different colours. That's good. Uh, a bit closer to the weed. Uh, this one's burning. It's one hell of a pot. Side. 
There's glass floor, but there's so little of it. Oops, sorry, mate. Uh, another star. Can I get round here? Uh, no, won't let me through there. Bugger. Right, let me in here, though. Appearance modifier. We can get on the other side anyway, so it doesn't make a difference. There's nothing over there anyway. Uh, the floor, which I hope will take my weight. And some uh, boxes. Boxes. Get out here. Are we, uh, wait. No, that's where we just were. In there. Would it be interesting? Oh, yeah, it's the modifier. It's just there. I thought it was another room then. We've got more windows to walk on. Chairs behind. Desks. So this is where you come for a job interview. Um, might be some sort of vending machine. I can imagine it as a vending machine. Coffee and uh, jet engine fuel. No problem. <laughs> Carry jet engine fuel in a plastic beacon though, it'll be a bunch. Uh, central wise, I think we just came up there, or did we come up there? No, that's where we came up, that stair. So we've got a bed, or rather three beds, in a kind of arch, an arc of bed. And the fishes can sing it asleep. Swinging round. Um, a red wall. I hope that's not a sign of prostitution. No, is that a full poster one with a face mask in a, in a suit? Something I don't get, obviously. Ah, uh, we was in here. Well, obviously we're in here. My memory was, we're in here with a big fire. What's that for? No power, but right, okay. Nice fireplace. I don't like the colours still, but there you go. Since they changed it. Right, more fish. Nutrient processors and... The meat's all processed. Ah, uh, <laughs> I don't want to say what that sound looks like. Microwave cookers, I guess. And the crew beds, I don't know, maybe crew beds? Nicely posted out, Cafe 42. Good wishes. Oh, good vibes, isn't it? Good vibes. Ah, uh, nice pink foot lockers a laurel leaf hope you're not dead in it two it's one up there as well is it the same one um that I don't know that I couldn't tell you let's turn around uh we came in where here okay there's that so there's the bed so yeah so this is where we would have come up. If we go the other way, we're taking a quick look in the central parts. A lot of uh, solar systems. And, uh, and the biodomes. And that should bring us back. Because that's the up. We go down here. Got another uh, ghoulie tickler. Automated feeder. Is it upside down? I don't know. Could be. Possible. Another ghoulie feeder. Is that where we came up? Oh, wait. That's where we came up. Because we went up the other stairs. Let's get down here then. Is that bit and then all we got left is really the centre 
Uh, is that? Wait, well, it's got nip nips in there, isn't it? Oh, standing planters. Oh, yeah, grass. Yeah, yeah. I see it now. I didn't see it before. Because I'm a bit slow. Signal boosters. That's the only problem is, I don't know where I am. <laughs> I should be near a door. Wait, that's the one we went up first, so it should be over here. In this gap, there's that door again. Shut again, please. How many is in there? There's got to be at least six in there because of the sides. But other than that, I don't know. This tube is rather glowy. I'm sure it's brighter than it should be. Well, we'll head back for the ship. And, um... We'll see you later. Ta-ra! It's daylight! I mean daylight. Night time! <laughs>